Hello class, good evening, how are you? Welcome, Carlos Miguel, good evening, Ivania. Ana Veronica, Jonathan, Guillermo Antonio, hello, welcome, welcome, good evening, enjoy your good day. Good evening. Good evening, Carlos good evening. Miguel. Good evening, excellent. We have a good uh, audio. Excellent, that's great. And I expect that also good, uh, in good conditions, the camera and the connectivity. Today, we're going to start our unit number three, okay? One step further, un paso adelante. Ya vamos con, miren, ya vamos a cuesta abajo. La otra semana terminamos, ¿verdad? Sí, la otra semana, el 19. Ok, recordemos que el día 15, day off. Y a propósito, veamos día 15, ¿qué, qué día es? Mm, jueves. Mm, hubiera sido viernes, mejor, ¿verdad? Friday, that would have been better. Hello, Danny, welcome. Jonathan, hello, hello. Ana hello, Verónica, yeah. welcome. I think that probably Ana Verónica is working. I don't know. Good evening. Good evening, Miss. Thank you for answering. It is so nice on you. Okay. So. Thank you, thank you, everyone. We, Guillermo, hello. We are one minute left. Dentro de un minuto iniciamos exactamente. Okay. Hello, hello. Hello, hello. How was your weekend? ¿Cómo estuvo el fin de semana? As why, okay. It was okay. okay. Excellent, very well. It was okay. Ivania, how was your weekend? It's fine. It was fine. Okay. And Jonathan, what about you? Your weekend? Good. It was good. Danny, your weekend? How was your weekend? It was okay. It was okay. And what about you, Carlos Miguel? It was uh, good. It was good. Great. And Miss Veronica, did you work on the weekend? It was good. It was good. Okay, probably you were working. Okay, class, so it is time to get started and all of you are really welcome, okay, to the class. And here we go. As I was telling you, today we're going to start with our section number three, unit number three. And we're going to have a little feedback on what we did last week, okay, which was basically about simple present tense and also yes, no questions, right? Okay, so here we go. I'm going to start sharing my PPT with you as every single day, okay? And I'm going to share with you my PPT and here. Okay, so today is September the 5th, yes? Is that okay? And uh, well, let's see, it is our video conference number 11. Greetings, it is our first activity as every day that we have been meeting here for 11 days, 11 sessions and feedback. Okay, today we're going to have a feedback, as I told you, on what we did last week. We're going to read the objectives, the objectives, and today we're going to work with information questions. So you are going to provide information. Um, and you're going to be asking about someone else's duties at the workplace. Okay, do you know the meaning of the word duties? Yes? ¿Sabemos el significado de la palabra duties no. or duties? Yes, Ivania? No. Okay, somebody said something. No. Duties are your activities, your tasks at the workplace, okay? It is another word that means the same. Your activities, your obligations, okay? Your assignments, your tasks at the workplace. And I expect that we're going to be working at pages 29 and 30. And here we go, okay? The specific objective and the class objective. Uh -huh. 
Let's see. One volunteer to help me reading. Who is going to help me reading? The objectives. Hello, only one volunteer. Come on, it's Monday. I know that it was. Thank you, Carlos. Thank you so much. I appreciate. I appreciate so much your participation because I know it is Monday, you woke up very early and, mm, but it is the beginning of a new week. Let's be positive. Okay, Carlos, please begin. A specific objective. Uh, participants will be able to ask questions about some else duties and the workplace at the workplace. Mm -hmm. Class objective, uh, participants will be able to ask information, question, and give our answer. Okay, thank you so much. And as you listen your partner, the specific objective is going to be for the unit, that you as participants will be able to ask questions about someone else's. Someone else's, here you have the possessive. Do you remember? Someone else's duties at the workplace, okay? Someone else's, okay? Duties, las actividades u obligaciones o tareas en el trabajo de alguien más. Someone, alguien más, okay? someone else, alguien más. And then as class objective, as Carlos read, participants will be able to ask information, questions and give out responses, answers, okay? So if I say for, okay, I'm going to tell you later. And here a reminder about homeworks and evaluations. So for, this coming Friday, you are expected to have finished the five homeworks for this week, okay? In this week, there is no exam, only the activities, okay? And feedback here. If you remember class, we were working with questions in simple present, yes, with do and does. In the last unit, in unit number two, we were practicing the ABC, the alphabet. Also, we were practicing the daily routines, but also, pero también, we were working with the days of the week. If you remember, yes, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, yes? Okay, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, the last day. Who wants to read the days of the week? One volunteer, please, to read the days of the week. Only one, only the days of the week, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Come on, it's Monday, but you need to, okay, to practice. One volunteer, one volunteer to read the days of the week, okay? Days of the week. Okay. Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Excellent. Very well done. Thank you so much. And here we have. What do you do? Mm, you were giving some information. If you remember when you answered this question, this direct question, what do you do? Mm, probably I check social networks at my work. I sell products. I talk to customers. I prepare the agenda and other activities. Do you remember? Do, okay? Do you do? Here you have the word do, the verb do, because do in this case, in this first part, is the modal auxiliary to construct the questions in simple present. And here in this last part is the main verb. 
en esta segunda parte es el verbo, es el verbo principal. Recuerdan, what do you do? Okay. And then you don't say, I do, I check. No, you say what you do directly. Usted dice directamente lo que hace. Ahí ya se olvida de I do, no. Yo hago, yo hago reviso las redes sociales en la empresa, no. Yo reviso las redes sociales. Por eso cuando contestamos ya no utilizamos do. I check social networks. I create logos. I talk to customers. I sell products. I install softwares. Okay. Or I, what else? I check the computers and so on. Right. And here we have this question because I know what you do and you know what your partners do at work. Ustedes saben lo que sus compañeros hacen en sus oficinas, en sus empresas, ¿sí o no? Hemos estado trabajando bastante. And now this is the question for today. Where do you belong to? Where do you belong to? If you ask me, teacher, In your company, where do you belong to? Mm, I belong to the teaching staff department. Yes. And here, for example, if someone asks you, where do you belong to? Uh, I work at the human resources department. I work at the sales department. I work at the maintenance department. I work at the communications department. I work at the accounting department. I work at credits department. I work at the production department. I work at the quality control department. I work at the financial department. I work at the purchasing department, departamento de compras. I work at the purchasing department. Or if there is another one, that's okay, right? So class, I'm going to share this with you right now via WhatsApp because this is the question we're going to be asking right now. Hmm. Over here. Mm -hmm. And here we go. Hello, welcome, welcome. Noé, nice to have you here. William Francisco, welcome. Francisco Enrique, welcome. David Emanuel, all of you are really welcome. Let me see. Hello, ah, Luz, you are here, great. And, oh, Milagro Mabelin is also here. Okay, remember the question, the key question for today is, where do you belong to? Obviously, referring to the company that you work for, okay? To your workplace, yes? And then some potential answers are like these ones. I, if I ask you, um, Ivania, where do you belong to? Uh, I work at the man management. Management department. Department. Or in some companies, they don't call them department, they say area, yes? Okay. Area, excellent. So it depends, department or area, they are kind of synonyms, yes? Area or department. So here we have some of them. And if you notice, I don't have here what Ivania said, yeah? And maybe there are some others that are not in here, but you are going to express it in the uh, breakout rooms, okay? So here we go, and here we have, what do you do at work, okay? Um, now you are able to construct longer, longer sentences, okay? What do you do at work? Mm, I check, write, and answer emails, or mm, I take and make calls and take messages. I prepare the agenda and attend meetings. Two or three activities at once. Now you are able to do them. Ahora ya están ustedes en la capacidad de describir tres, dos, tres o cuatro actividades de una vez de las que realizan en el trabajo. Sí o no? Las han practicado mucho. Call clients and sell products. I read, check and write reports. 
I turn on the computer, I work on the computer and turn off the computer. Yes, first you turn on the computer, later you work on the computer. And at the end, I turn off the computer, right? Yeah, okay, I'm going to uh, share this with you guys also, okay? Via WhatsApp, because these are the two questions you are going to be asking and answering in the breakout rooms. Okay. Jose Pacheco, hello. Okay, Noah, hello. Okay, now class, do you have any question about the activities that you are going to be practicing with in the in the breakout rooms? Questions, comments? Preguntas, comentarios sobre las dos preguntas que van a estar uh, trabajando en los breakout rooms? Yes? If there is a question, please ask me right now. Si hay preguntas o algo no está claro, por favor, lo vamos a clarificar en el momento. Yes? Hello? Everything is clear? Where do you belong to? And yes. what do you do at work? Yeah? Okay, no problem. No. Shall we? Okay, we. Okay, here we go. Let me see how many students. Okay, when you come back from that activity, I'm going to check your attendance. And here we go. Ah, but I'm going to give you the power to share your screen if you want to. Pueden compartir pantalla cuando estén en equipo si así lo desean, okay? Let's see how many students in each. Mm -hmm. Pero, ¿y por qué? Alguien está conectado con dos dispositivos. Quiero ver, porque me aparecen 14, solamente son 13, 9. Okay, hold it. Permítame, lo vamos a recrear porque aquí esta plataforma me. Okay. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. Okay, here we go. There is one group of four students and the others are three students. Remember to take turns to ask and answer the two questions, okay? No es que uno le va a hacer las preguntas a todos y los demás van a contestar. Yo le pregunto a Jonathan, Jonathan, Jonathan le pregunta a, Anto, a Guillermo, Guillermo le pregunta a Madeline, Madeline le pregunta a Verónica y así, okay? Here we go. Ah, hold it. Ana Verónica. Y porque me aparece alguien que, ¿quién acaba de salir? Porque ya se me quedó otro equipo solo con dos estudiantes. Ay, no. Bueno. Entonces vamos a hacer esto. Vamos a transferir. Porque no pueden haber uno de cuatro, uno de tres y alguien de, de dos. Ok, here we go. I'm going to send you the invitation right now. There you are. Okay. Go to your groups, please, if you are so nice and ask and answer two questions. Go to your groups and ask and answer the two questions. Okay. I need Luz Filomena, I need you in group number two. Luz Filomena en el equipo 2, por favor. Luz en el equipo 2, si es tan amable, please. Equipo 2, Luz. Um, Laura. Hello, uh, hello, Carlos, and hello, Guillermo. 
In no. this group, it is supposed to be Luz Filomena with you, but I think that she's having problems with her connectivity or maybe she's on her way home, okay? Probably. What is a question? The two questions, two questions. Two questions. Uh-huh. Mm. Where, where do you belong to? Ah, entonces acá le voy a asignar a Serafín. Está ingresando en este momento. Ay, Filomena también. Ya veo este grupo. Este es el equipo que me quedo de cuatro. Vaya, veamos si a Filomena sí si está teniendo problemas porque con dos dispositivos está tratando de ingresar. Las dos preguntas son las que están en las dos diapositivas que les compartí. Ok. Ok. Uh, where do you belong to and what do you do at work? Ok. Okay, so um, Guillermo, ask me the first question, please. A Carlos. No, a mí. Ah, perdón, perdón, perdón. Okay. Eh, what do you be, What do you be, belong, belong? Belong. Belong. To where? Repeat where, after me, Guillermo. Repeat after me. Where? Where? Do you? Do you? Belong. Belong to to. Uh, I belong to the teaching staff. Okay. La segunda. Yes, the second question. What do you do at work? Um, I prepare classes. I teach classes. I monitor students. Um, I also evaluate students. Okay and I prepare evaluations. Yes, so yes. that's it. And then I'm going to ask you and so on, okay? So Guillermo, Antonio, you ask the question to Carlos and maybe, maybe Carlos asked the question to Serafin and Serafin asked the questions to Luz, okay? Okay. Hello. Yes, Serafin, you are here. Yes. Okay. Uh, good evening, welcome in, in Filomena also, ok. Entonces, eh, comienzan ustedes dos chicos con las preguntas y las respuestas para que los compañeros vean, ¿verdad? Por eso le pedí a Guillermo que me hiciera las preguntas para que vieran cómo vamos a trabajar, ok. Van a okay. preguntar y responder las dos preguntas que están arriba de las dos diapositivas que les compartí vía WhatsApp, ok. Ok, let's begin, Guillermo, ask the questions to Carlos. Where do you be, 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 belong? belong? Belong to. Excellent. Carlos? Okay. Um, wh where do you belong to, Veronica? Eh, uh, esa es la primera. Esa es la primera este pregunta. Sí. Esta. Eh, la. La anterior, la pregunta anterior no la puedes poner para copiarla. Yo no tengo la guía esa. Okay. No, en el, en el en chat WhatsApp. de WhatsApp. En WhatsApp, ¿En WhatsApp? está. Sí. Sí. Ok, espera a ver. Ah, sí, a la vez. ¿Cuánto de dual work? Okay. Okay, let's practice, let's practice. Es que estaban algo perdidos los compañeros en, en que lo que tenían que hacer, como acaban de entrar unos. Oh, muy bien. Sí. ok. Bueno, entonces, um, Jonathan, ask me the question, nice. the first question. You ask me. Ok. Where do you, where do you belong to? I belong to the teaching staff department. Okay. Uh, what do you do at work? Um, I prepare classes, I teach classes, I monitor students, I evaluate students, and I also prepare evaluations, okay? Okay. Okay. Uh, Jonathan, where do you belong to? I work at the AT department. 
And what do you do at work? I I publish web service. I analyze code computer. Um, I participate uh, in meetings daily. Okay, excellent. Congratulations. Now, Jonathan, you ask the questions to Danny or William Francisco or Noah. Okay. Okay. Bye. Excellent. Okay, William. Uh, William, where do you where do you do belong to? Where do you belong to? ¿Qué significa? Eh, a, ¿A qué pertenece? ¿A qué, ¿A qué departamento? departamento o área perteneces en el trabajo? Ay. Sales, sales department. Uh, sales department. Ok. Francisco, could you please uh, tell me what do you do at work? I check emails. I visit to, uh, to clients. Visit, visit to clients. Client. I prepare the what? Quotes, very well. The quotes. Hey, I, could you spell that, please? Quotes. Mm -hmm. Ah, okay. Quotes. Quotes. What? C O U T E. Okay. No, solo otros. <laughs> Finish it. <laughs> Finish. Okay, great. I think that you are the only group because you are only three. But in this group, nobody is having problems with the internet connectivity. No. 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 Because in the other groups, Almost everybody's having problems because of the heavy rain this evening. Yeah. Es que la, la tormenta viene del oriente al occidente y ahorita acaba el, como luces de la unión viene para. Oh, that is tipo, why. Tipo nueve y media va a estar lloviendo aquí en, el, aquí en el centro y luego en el occidente se va a mover más nochecito. Así okay. entiendo yo que viene la tormenta. Estaba oh, revisando. really? Oh, really? Ah, okay. The so rain. let's take advantage of the connectivity. So, ¿Sí? Miss. Um, Miss Ivania, yes. uh, where, where does Madeline belong to? Where does Madeline belong to? She belongs to? Uh, Madeline, Madeline where the tax department, tax department. Excuse me? Department. Oh, sales department. Okay, uh, Vero, Ana Veronica. Where does Ivania belong belong to? Where does Ivania belong to? Uh, Ivania at Ivania at work uh, manager customer. Uh, Ivania belongs to the manager customer. Mm, uh, mm, customer management. Department, Costum yeah. Customer management, okay. Okay, very well. Uh, <laughs> excellent. And Madeline, where does Ana Veronica belong to? Ana belong to audit uh, tax department. Okay, excellent. So if you notice, I was asking you about someone else's duties, and or about someone else's department, yeah? Where does she belong to? Les preguntaba sobre alguien más, no les hice la pregunta directa sobre eh, eh, la información de ustedes, ¿de acuerdo? Sí. sí. Entonces, ahí ya vamos logrando el objetivo de esta noche. ¿Se dan cuenta cómo poquito a poquito sí ya van construyendo su conocimiento, verdad? Okay. De eso se trata, step by step. So, don't be shy to talk. Please. And Ana Marlene Andrade is joining. Excellent. We're going to get back to the main session room, okay? Because you're going to practice more in the in the manual. So here we go. 
I'm going to close all the rooms and I'm going to take the attendance because now I have more students. Okay. Okay, let's get back. Thank you for practicing class in the breakout rooms. I was monitoring all the teams and you were working. You were giving your best effort, okay? So I'm going to take the attendance and I'm going to ask you to turn off your microphones if you are so nice. Okay, so you can be able to listen when I say your name. Thank you. Let's wait for the others. Let me check. Group number three is still working. Daniel, William, Jonathan is coming back. Okay. Everybody's here, I think. Yes, by now, everyone, at least all there was. And Noel lost the connectivity. No, he perdió la conexión. Okay, here we go. Ana Marlene, Marlene. Ana Marlene. Here. Okay. Here I am. Thank you, Miss. Ana Verónica. Here I am. Great. Barbara, Susana. Barbara is not at the moment. Carlos Miguel. Carlos Miguel lost the connectivity, but he was here. Carlos Miguel, hello, Carlos Miguel, are you here? Carlos Miguel, first call. Carlos Miguel, Umaña Lobo, second call. Carlos Miguel, Umaña Lobo, third call. The plane. Está, está, pero no responde. Ahí está, pero no responde. Sí, lo que sucede es que no sé si tendrá problema de audio o qué. Ajá, sí. Porque sí ha estado desde el inicio de la clase. Bueno, contestará en la segunda. And then, um, Lelia is not, going, is not going to be here today. She has problem. And then, Daniel Alberto. Dani. Hello, Dani. Present teacher. Thank you. Uh, David Emanuel. Present teacher. Thank you. Filomena Luz. Present. Okay, thank you. Thank God you 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 have your connectivity okay right now. Francisco Enrique. Present. Thank you. Guillermo Antonio. Present. Thank you. Ivania Elizabeth. Present. Great. Jonathan. Here I am. Thank you, sir. Jose Armando Pacheco. Good night, I'm here. Good evening, thank you. Good evening. Jose Good. Manuel Mejia. Jose Manuel. It is not here at the moment. Karina Vanessa. Vane is absent at the moment. Madeline, Milagro Madeline. Present. Thank you, Miss. Noah, Noé is ahí. Noé. Yes, Carlos Miguel. Present. I'm sorry, está lloviendo. Okay. Yes. I guess that. Me imaginé. Noé está teniendo problemas con la conexión. Noah, Noé. Are you back? No, not yet. Serafín. Here I am. William Francisco. Present. Okay. So here we go, class. Let's continue. And now we're going to work in teams in the breakout rooms, but pay close attention to what you're going to do. In your manual class, you're going to work on this. Unit three, where do you work? Hmm. 
brainstorm about the different departments in your workplace. Where do you belong to and what do you do? You already did this, okay? Ya realizamos esta etapa, sí o no? El ejercicio uno, because those were the questions that you were asking. So yes. it is, okay, very well. Now, you're going to listen to your teacher with the following departments in a company. Then you are going to match them with the activities that they perform. Production, research and development, purchasing, marketing, human resources, accounting and finance. Production, research and development, purchasing, marketing, human resources, management, human resources, management, accounting and finance. Here you have the choices, some activities, but you need to write here the number that according to the activity belongs to this department. They research and identify what customers want and need at the right place. They recruit, select and train new employees for the right job in the company. Keep the financial record of transactions involving monetary inflows and outflows. They control and supervise the production workforce and inventory. They develop, design, new or improve existing products or processes. They buy and acquire raw materials, production equipment, etc. for the use of the organization. Raw materials, materiales, materia prima, okay? They buy and acquire raw materials, production equipment, et cetera, for the use of the organization. You're going to work uh, here at page 29, okay? At page 29 is what you are going to be working with, okay? In unit three. Are we clear about what you're going to be working with and the teams? Yes? Yes. Okay, yes. here we go. At page 29, Okay, I'm going to stop sharing. And here we go. I'm going to recreate the groups because, you know, some of your partners are absent at the moment because of the connectivity. Mm -hmm. Ay. Siempre me quedo un equipo de dos esta plataforma. Okay, it's better this way. Mm. Marlene, usted está con un dispositivo, ¿verdad? Yes. Okay, con great. Okay, excellent. ¿Dónde está esta chica? One, two, three, four, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. Okay. Let's expect that you're going to have a good connectivity. Here we go. The invitation right now. Join your groups, please. Join your groups. Unanse a sus equipos. Join your groups. And match the departments to their activities. Yo necesito a Francisco Enrique en el equipo 3. Y necesito, ay, Noé, qué bueno sí. que ya regresó. Me Pero, está costando con la con, Sí, con me, la imaginé, me imaginé. Vaya, entonces va a ser el equipo 3. No, yo creo, ajá, en el... Varios han tenido problemas en esa situación, ok. ¿Ya le llegó la invitación, Noé? Noé, ok. Francisco Enrique Saldaña, team number three. La primera que vi, la primera, hola, teacher. Hi, teacher. Hola, acá está Noé. 
Sí, sí, es que <risa> tiene problemas con la conexión, lo lamento, pero verdad. Okay. Sí, ajá, entonces un feedback le estábamos haciendo la primera actividad que hicimos, que era la de eh, identificar este, a qué área pertenecíamos cuando preguntábamos, where do you belong to? Y entonces ahí respondíamos. Por ejemplo, eh, profession and occupation, ¿sí? Eh, supervisor. Supervisor. Ajá, supervisor. Entonces, ahí nosotros, ahí nosotros en, en esa oportunidad, cuando le preguntamos, ¿Where do you belong to? ¿A dónde perteneces? ¿A qué área pertenece esa supervisión que usted realiza? Eh, ahí se llama, es mantenimiento predictivo, pero mantenimiento es maintenance, algo así. Maintenance. Maintenance. Ah, ok, entonces ahí usted respondía. I work at maintenance department, por ejemplo. For, for example. Ah, okay. Ajá. Y luego la otra era, la, la segunda pregunta era, what do you do at work? ¿A qué, este, ¿a qué te dedicas? Ahí usted comenzaba a, a ¿cómo se llama? A, um, Cuarenta y nueve, doce. Sí. Ok, ahorita le comparto. Y ella la, ella la va a pegar ahí, este, Guillermo. Mm, no creía que pueda. Sí, pues sí, madre. <risa> ¿Y dónde es que está niña? Dios mío. Ay, Vanessa. Estaba acá, pero la conexión está fallando y la envía al otro equipo y hoy. Sí. Y hoy me resulta acá. Ya habrá llegado ¿vale? en este momento la voy a enviar a otro equipo que me ha quedado con dos participantes. Ok, let's begin, let's Teacher, begin working, no, yes. No pude, eh, la, la, la página no la pudimos, ah, bueno, perdón, Guillermo la va a compartir. Okay. La pantalla. Estoy tratando, pero no me, no me da. Estoy bien. De opción. El osito, el, osito, el osito mayor está enfermo. Bueno, pero ustedes tienen, ustedes tienen el, el manual. Ahorita lo voy a ver, licenciada. Okay, es que si me salgo okay. me, me saca no, del No, pero, pero ahí, pero ahí cada quien en el manual vaya, vaya. Correcto. Y Ahorita voy a ver. Para que avancen, para aprovechar la conexión. Correcto. No vaya a ser que, ¿verdad? El osito mayor tiene temperatura. Dele, dele. Hello, Vane is Con here, back with you. Porque Vane ha andado ah. así en la nube. De aquí para ah, okay. allá, con problemas de conexión. Entonces, Vanessa, Ana Verónica, Noah, en Milagro. You are in this team. Okay, team number three. Okay, bye. Bye. Okay. Entonces voy. Ahí me corrigen, ¿Eh? por favor. Sí, dale, no hay tren. Control. No se preocupe, aquí se les va a corregir. <risa> <risa> y este equipo lo van a corregir. Yes. Uh -huh. Ay, no pero ver y este era qué ah no perdón este es el 4 ya me confundí ajá develop eh, is for yes um, cuál nos falta eh, number one production control uh, 
Control y supervisión de productos. Trabajo de inventario. Mano de obra, inventario. Uh, son control and supervise the production, workforce and inventory. Mm. No creo que dé con producción. ¿Con so, cuál iría marketing? Marketing. El 4. El, el, el primero es el 4. Ok. Ok, the second recruits, sell and the train new employer for their job. The company is human records management. No five. le puedo poner la palabra, la cinco. Sí, five. Five. Ya terminamos, teacher, con esa actividad. Ok, congratulations. And... Could you please review? Okay. No, check, not review. Okay, check. Check, okay, or verify. Number two, research and develop. Mm. Maybe number two is not that one. Probably. Ah, yo, ten, yo tenía dudas en eso. Yo, yo creo que era la cuatro. Y la que tenemos como cuatro es la dos. Ok. Hagan ahí el cambio. Permítanme que alguien quiera ingresar. José Mejía. Ok, veamos. Cuatro. Uh -huh. Marketing, research and identify what customers send and need at the right place, ¿ya? Sí, porque hacen estudio de mercado, ¿verdad? And then, number five. Human resources management, recruit, select and train. Esa que sea la más fácil, ¿verdad? De no perderse. Number six. Keep the financial hours so easy. Record of transactions involving monetary inflows and outflows. Number one, control and supervise the production, workforce, and inventory. Mm. Number two, research and de develop, design, and improve existing products or processes. Number three. Uh, number three is easy. Buy and acquire. Uh -huh. Yes. Okay, very well. That's great. Only one was wrong, right? Very, very well. Okay. And uh, let's see. Uh, William Francisco. I have a question for you, William Francisco. Sí, que tengo un problema con, con la aplicación, no me aparecen las imágenes. ¿Qué era? ¿Con cuál aplicación, William? Esta, la de Zoom. ¿Cómo así? No la ¿Cómo? veo en la parte de arriba, pero ya la imagen. Usted, la imagen usted está en teléfono. Sí. Ah, probablemente tiene que mover el... para que pueda ver las imágenes. Sí, ya lo moví, nada. Es creo que tengo que salir y volver a acceder. Ah, oh, pero le tengo una pregunta antes de que se vaya. William. Mm. Ok. Mm. Where do you belong to? I work in sales department. Ok. And what do you do? Uh, I sell products. I visit okay. customers. I collect the money of the customers. Mm -hmm. Excellent. Among others, etc. Right? Etc. Mm -hmm. Porque hay más actividades. Very well. Excellent. Okay. Now we're going to get back to the main session room. We're going to double check and discuss these answers because probably some of your partners are, you know, not all of them, but maybe, maybe, tal vez, 
somebody is uh, wrong with one definition, okay? So let's double check. Thank you, William, for your answers. I'm going to close the rooms. Thank you. And Jose Pacheco, having dinner. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Now we're going to double check, okay? Let's wait for a while for the others. Filomena, Serafin, and Jose Mejia are still there. Okay. Okay, class, here we go. Hello, Jose Mejia, welcome. Good evening, nice to have you here. Hello, hello. Hello, hello. Okay, class, now we're going to double check and let's see if we have the same, okay? So, okay. Research and identify what customers want and need at the right place. That is, tell me the department. Marketing. Okay, number four, marketing. Four. Okay, marketing, excellent. Now, recruit, select, and train new employees for the right job in the company. That is the department. Hi. Human resources management. Okay. In this department, they keep the financial record of transactions involving monetary inflows and outflows. That is number six. Number six. Accounting and finance. Great. Now, in the next one, this staff is in charge of the control and they supervise the production workforce and inventory. Hello? Number one. Number one. Number one. Okay. The next one. They develop, design, new or improve in existing products or processes. To. Research and develop. Research and develop. And the last one, they buy and acquire raw materials, production equipment, etc., for the use of the organization. Purchasing. Number three, okay? Is everybody in agreement or does anybody have a different answer? Agreement. Okay, everybody is in agreement. Now listen, if I ask you, maybe to someone, where do you belong to? Oh, I belong to, or I work at the purchasing department. And what do you do? Then you are going to describe the activities, as many activities as you remember that you and your coworkers, do in your department. This is activity number three. You are going to explain to a partner, but in the groups, okay? What activities you and a coworker do in your department? Yes? If you say, uh, I belong to, or I work at the accounting and finance department or area, and we Keep the financial record of transactions involving monetary inflows and outflows. And besides that, y además de eso, ¿qué otras actividades hacen? Tantas actividades como sea posible, ustedes van a describir sus actividades y el área en la que trabajan. 
¿ok? Y luego alguien más nos la va a presentar acá. Yes. I can say, for example, Jonathan belongs to the IT department. Yes, Jonathan. Yes. Ok. Um, they, they give maintenance to computers. They install softwares and antiviruses. They, maybe they, they check the internet connection. Yes. And others, because I am not a specialist on that, but Jonathan is going to explain to the class what he and his co-workers do, okay, in that department. Is it clear? ¿Están claras las instrucciones de lo que van a realizar, jóvenes? Sí. Yo describo mi, eh, menciono yes. mi departamento y describo las actividades prácticamente todas las actividades que realizamos en, eh, en mi área, ¿sí? O en mi departamento, ¿de acuerdo? Ok. And later you are going to read to your partners in the breakout rooms, ¿ok? Pero cuando regresemos, alguien, ejemplo, Milagro va a describir las actividades que eh, William Francisco realiza, por ejemplo, en su puesto de trabajo, ¿sí? No va a decir usted la suya, va a decir la de alguien más, ¿ok? So here we go. Let's get back to the main session room. Acá tengo alguien de cinco. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three. Ok, here we go. Les envío la invitación en este momento, chicos. Ok. ¿Ya le llegó la invitación? Go to your groups, please. Go to your groups. And work hard. Mm, Serafín y Filomena los necesito en el equipo uno. Filomena Luz, Lucy. Thank you. Yes. ¿Cómo era la, pre la pregunta que dio la ticha? Vamos a decir en qué departamento estamos y qué actividades hacemos. Pero, pero dijo una pregunta para... Wow. Son, la, son, son las mismas preguntas que están que hicieron desde el inicio de la clase. Son esas que están acá en la actividad número uno, pero yo se las puse en las diapositivas que les compartí. Okay, okay. Where, do you, where do you belong to and what do you do? Okay. Pero al inicio mencionaron una o dos actividades. Ahora la descripción de las actividades va a ser más completa. ¿De acuerdo? ¿Sí? Sí comprendimos, Marlene. Sí. Ok. Ok, let's begin working. Primero tiene que construir su, su, su descripción, ¿verdad? De su trabajo y las actividades que hace. Y luego las comparte. Ok. Ok, ok. Ok, see you later. Ay. Me escuchan. Casi sí, no se le escucha, se le escucha. Sí, sí, se escucha. Fuerte y claro, fuerte y claro. Casi no le escucho porque ya está lloviendo fuerte. Bueno, eh, tienen que, eh, sí, no es, pero como. Comprendió la actividad que van a realizar, ¿no es? Eh? Perdón, Serafín, Serafín, que no he acaba de ingresar al... al sí, eh, es que está lloviendo mucho, vea. Sí, 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 me imagino. Sí. Escucho algo. Este, vaya, pero sí comprendió lo que va a realizar, la actividad que va a realizar. Sí. Ah, sí. vaya, entonces trabajen. Es lo que primero... va a hacer en la actividad que están haciendo, ¿verdad? Correcto, y el departamento al que pertenece, sí, individualmente y luego lo comparte, sí. Ok. Ah, 
Bueno, bueno. Ok, bye. Gracias. Science and um, technology, tech technology, technology. Creo que está ahí, sí, algo así. No, Falta una, una o. Yes, that's correct. Ajá. Ok. Um, uh -huh. What do you do at work? Uh, prepare, prepare a share research protocol. Okay, excellent. So um, you see we're learning. Wow. Uh, create a and manage, uh, manage a virtual server. Virtual server. Virtual server. Virtual. Listo, bueno, el marker, marker restart. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, okay, says. The design advertising. Advertisements. 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 Uh -huh. Like this. I'm going to okay. show it to you. Okay. Here. Design. Advert. Advertisements. Okay. Oh, hold it. Hold it. Hold it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> okay. okay. Advertisements. Yeah. Okay. okay. And, and design strategy. A strategy. A strategy. Okay. Ahora va Noé o Vanessa. Two. Okay. I work at the IT department. Ah, uh -huh. I work at the IT department. IT. Hi, teacher. Hello. Are you ready? Daniel? Almost, almost. Almost. And Ivania is ready, of course. Ivania is still lista también. Ooh, long time ago. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So I think you don't have a problem with the activity, only that you are waiting for Danny. Yes, no, pro, no hay problemas. Solo esperando a Danny, verdad? Okay, yes. Yes. Okay, great. Okay. I'm gonna help. I'm gonna help. Okay. Ay, me están grabando. Bye. Entonces, bye bye. I run away. Voy a mencionar sus actividades, Van. Sería. Vane, Vanessa at work receptionist administrative. Okay, I, repeat, repeat, repeat. O sea, ella es receptionista administrativa, pero. Okay, no. Uh, Vanessa works in the administration, in the ah, administration ah, area or department. Sí, porque la, la recepción es parte de lo administrativo. Ah, pues solo sería administrativo. Uh, works in the administrative area or in the administration. Mm -hmm. oh. Administration. Yeah. Y en algunos lugares le llaman administrative uh, department. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Continue. Okay. Continue. Bye. Pero ahí hay una cosa, teacher. Cuando yo hablo de ella, uh -huh. como hemos aprendido el verbo, 
Bueno, uh -huh. aquí porque es la, la occupation o el department de ella. Sí, de ella. Cuando yo comienzo a hablar de sus actividades, tengo que hacerlo siempre agregando la forma uh -huh. S que hemos venido aprendiendo. ¿verdad? Sí, puede ser de ella o en general o de, él, de, o de... de ellos, porque como es de ti y de tu compañero o compañeros, lo que hacen en ese departamento. Ajá. Uh -huh. Ajá, podría ser de ella. Ajá, bueno, pero en este caso de ella, ¿vale? Okay. She receives calls. She receives calls. Recuerden que si lo van a hacer en tercera persona de singular, no Ajá, olvidar sí. los cambios verbales. Ajá. Sí, sí, sí pero si lo hacen con they, ahí es más fácil porque el verbo va tal cual, no, ¿sí? No, no, ajá, ok. Ok, eh, continue, continue. She bears she, <laughs> she hospital service. Ajá. Uh -huh. She provides information hospital service. Uh -huh. Vaya, solamente, solo eso. Only that. Es no. que para, es que somos varios, entonces para participar. Ah, ok, ok, ok. So you did it great. You did it great. Uh -huh. Continue, Bye. continue. Who else? Ahora que sea, que sea otra persona que mm -hmm. escriba. Yes. The, someone else. Yeah. Someone else. Someone else's duties. Someone else. Someone else. ¿Alguien más? Okay. Tiene que hacer. Este, ok, eh, eh, Madeline. Ok. Um, Verónica works at the tax department. Um, she supervises activities team. She supervises. Um, she supervises activities uh -huh. things. Uh -huh. um, arrange visit clients arranges arranges visit visits clients. to the clients mm -hmm. to the client yes um, hasta ya no te <laughs> la otra no lo entendí <laughs> oh my God, come sí. on okay. okay someone else yes alguien más hi teacher okay francisco enrique eh, Noé Hernández. Ok. De Mechanic Department. Ok. Eh, he supervise equip equipment. Equipment. He supervises. He supervises equipment. Yes. Eh, he prepared the, the quad. Okay. okay. Uh, only that. Solamente. Okay. Someone else? Voy yo. Okay, Just. Jose. Okay. Uh, Francis, uh, Francisco Ward Sales Department. Sales Department. Sales Department. Yes. Uh, He check email. He checks emails. He visit client. He, he supervise project. He supervises project. Supervises project. Excellent. Very well. And now sí. Noah, Noé. Teacher, yo hace, mire, yo, yo llegué aquí ya después. Solo formulé mis. Lo suyo. Vaya, sí, entonces lo léala, léalo, léalo, léalo. Ok. I work at the report. I work at the supervise. No, 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 no. I work at the... ¿En cuál departamento trabaja usted? Eh, mantenimiento. Ah, Man. ok, vaya. Entonces lo vamos a hacer así, mire. Tiene dos formas de hacerlo. Usted ha tenido problemas con el inter ahora. I Bastante. belong to the Yeah, I think so. If, if it is not, correct me, please. Me corrigen si me equivoqué en alguna letra. D we department Ok, puede decir esto, or I work at the 
¿ok? Tiene dos formas de decirlo. I belong to the mm. or I work at the. Lo mismo significa, sí. pero dice, acá menciona usted el área o departamento en la que trabaja. Y luego puede decir usted, we, porque no, no hace solo usted esa actividad, tiene otros compañeros de trabajo, ¿verdad? Sí. Entonces, we, y comienza a mencionar las actividades. ¿Qué es lo que hace? ¿Qué do you do at work? Eh, Supervise. ¿Qué cosa supervisa? Eh, el trabajo de los mecánicos. De mechanics. Mechanics performance. Okay, what else? Y también inventory, inventario. Okay, I do inventories. What else? Y realizo también los pedidos. Uh, okay, okay. Um, lo vamos a hacer así. Okay, uh, we supervise the mechanics performance, do inventories and check. ¿Qué dijo que revisaba? Eh, o la última I... actividad. Hago los, los pedidos de material. Ok. Um, order de uh, raw. Uy. Order de raw materials. Place the orders. I place, place the orders. Uy. Place the orders. of the raw material, the raw material. Yes? Yes. Uh-huh. Okay. Yes? Yes. Okay, great. Okay. May I erase? Yes. Yes. ¿Puedo borrar? Ya. Yeah. Ok, continue sí. practicing. Because in the, in the main session room right now, you're going yes. to describe yes. Sí. someone else's duties at work. Eh, cuando regresemos, van a describir las eh, actividades u obligaciones que alguien más realiza en el trabajo de los miembros de su equipo, porque de ellos es que ustedes saben en este momento, ¿sí? ¿De acuerdo? No todos, ¿verdad? Pero sí voluntarios, porque no van a leer todos los 17, ¿sí? Porque tenemos que seguir avanzando, ¿ok? Ok. Yes, here we go. Now, let's get back to the main session room, because I think that it has been enough time, ¿ok? okay. Okay, thank you for your participation class. Okay, let's wait for the other partners. Me pareció que José Pacheco sí ingresó, ¿verdad? Pero no sé si tendrá problema con la conexión. Dejó un mensaje en WhatsApp. Dijo en el chat, sí. Oh, sí. Es, ha estado teniendo problemas, pero sí ingresó, ¿verdad? Sí ingresó en la primera, en la primera parte. Sí. Okay. ok, thank you. Okay, thank you. Let's wait for the other partners.
horrible. I was talking to myself. Me estaba hablando a mí misma. Mi misma. Okay, because the microphone was off. And now it is the time for you to shine. Momento de brillar. This is your moment on internet to shine. Volunteers to describe someone else's routine. Okay. Thank you, Carlos, Miguel. Remember, you are going to describe another partner's place of work. I mean, the area where they work and the activities or duties they do. Okay. Thank you, Carlos. Uh, we are okay. all ears for you. Uh, Jonathan, uh, uh, it's for IT department. Uh, and analyze and create software solution at the specification in the document requirement. Um, and William sells a uh, word uh, in the sales department, general report of sale and the shipping. Collect the money to the customer and sell the product. And sells the products. But remember, Jonathan supervises. Supervises. Okay. Recuerden, si van a hablar de una sola persona, singular, en presente simple, hacemos el cambio en el verbo. Organizes, supervises, coordinates, types, checks, revise, buys. Okay. Um, what else? Monitors, for example, writes, reads, okay, reports. Okay, very well. Thank you so much. Excellent. And now another participant. Otro participante de otro equipo. Hey, come on, come on. What's going on? ¿Qué pasa? ¿Qué pasa? Okay. I'm going to, no van a leer a todos los compañeros, a uno nada más. ¿Verdad? Y Carlos, ¿por qué no hizo el favor de leerlos a todos? ¿Sí? Ok. Thank you, Guillermo. <laughs> Your microphone, Guillermo. Vamos a intentarlo, teacher. Ok, go for it. That is the idea. Filomena. <laughs> Manager Pastelería Lorena. Ok. She, eh, she eh, works in the, the manager's office. Ok. Ok. Eh, make inventory. She makes inventory. She places orders. She places orders. She supervisor of person. She supervises the staff. Uh -huh, yeah. Or the personal, the staff or the personal. Finish. <laughs> Excellent. Hey, very well done. Congratulations. So you see, you can do it. Okay, another participant from another group. Hello. Okay, I'm going to check. I'm going to let you. Okay, only one is missing. Uh, in the last team, Danny, Alberto, David, Emanuel, and Ivania. Who's going to be? <laughs> okay, teacher. Thank okay. you, David, Emanuel. Great. Yeah. Okay, Ivania. Ivania, in this case, Ivania is the plane, plane training. Okay. Uh, she checks answer emails. She checks GPS. Okay. She calls customer. Only teacher. She calls customers. Okay, excellent. Very well. Now I want you to notice this, okay? Let's remember the WH question words, okay? Where? It is about a place, okay? We use it to ask 
for a place. Yes or no? Where lo utilizamos para hacer una pregunta acerca de un lugar o una ubicación. For example, where do you live? But we have been practicing hmm, what happened here. Where do you live? And then we have been practicing where do you work? Or in the manual, we have where do you belong to? Yes or no? Mm -hmm. And then the other WH question word is what? Yes or no? Esta es la otra palabra que utilizamos para estructurar la pregunta. What do you do? ¿Qué haces? What do you do? ¿Qué haces? ¿De qué trabajas? Or, more specifically, lo que hemos estado trabajando esta noche. What do you do at work? In other words, here you are asking about the duties that that person you are asking to perform at work. En otras palabras, le están preguntando a esa persona directamente cuáles son sus actividades laborales o sus obligaciones en la compañía. Sí, duties. Is that okay? Yes. Yes, Comentario, yes. pregunta. Okay, very well. Okay, so here, let me see. One more thing. Okay. Hi. Hola, hola. Hello. Me regalas las preguntas, por favor. ¿Cuáles preguntas? Las que escribió para copiarlas. Ah. A ver si no se borra. Para recortar la sesión. A, a ver si no se borra. Eh, se borraron. Es que cuando se sale uno de la aplicación se elimina. ¿Alguien las escribió? Pero básicamente sí. era solo. Sí. Where, ah, tal vez las puede, las puede compartir. Básicamente sí. les hacía énfasis sure. en las dos. En las dos sure ok, great, excellent. Les hacía énfasis en las dos WH question words que hemos estado trabajando. En esta sesión, what and where. Where to ask about a place, okay? Location. And what to ask for information, okay? What do you do at work, okay? What time do you get up? Vaya, vamos a construir acá una lluvia de preguntas que inician con what. Ustedes me dictan, se convertirán en dictadores esta noche. Okay, so here. Porque le escribí muchos ejemplos con where, now with what. What questions. Estas son information questions. Where and what. Se le llama uh, information questions porque pedimos información. Si yo le digo, what time do you get up? No me va a decir, yes, yes I do or yes I get up. No, porque recuerden, con do y das son las yes no questions, ¿verdad? Que tenemos posibilidad de contestar en forma afirmativa o negativa. Pero en este caso, what questions, si decimos what do you do at work? What do you do at work? Entonces yo le estoy pidiendo información sobre your duties at work, tus actividades en el trabajo. ¿Ok? Tell me another question that begins with what that we use every day. Common questions. What time is it? Excuse me? What time is it? Excellent. What time is it? What time is it? Yo necesito información sobre el tiempo, ¿sí? Another one? Did that check. begins, yes? What, what time happened? do you start to work? <laughs> What time do what you start to work? Do you start to work? Okay. okay. Yes, somebody else, Veronica. What happened? Ah, what happened? In past tense, what happened? Yes, there was another one. 
what I mean, are what are you doing this weekend wow what are you doing this weekend entonces está pidiendo mucha información verdad por eso se le llama information question y si se fijan la estructura comienza con wh igual que la palabra where también es una WH question words, por eso se le llama preguntas que inician con WH. Where, what? En este caso solo estamos viendo dos, ¿ok? Another question that begins with what? What is your name? Yes? What is your favorite color? Hey, great. What is your favorite? Color. Very well. Okay, excellent. What is weather like? What is the weather like? Ay, ¿cómo está el clima? Rainy. Chubioso, yeah? Okay, very well. So I think that there's no problem with this, the, these two WH question words. Where and what, okay? Shall we move to the next activity? Yes? Yes. yes. Okay, so here we go. I'm going to stop sharing. And here we go back to the, to our book, okay? After this activity, we went through at the beginning with the slides, okay, that I showed you in my PPT, these two questions. And later you worked in the breakout rooms with this activity and afterwards you went through the in context uh, exercise number three. And now here, where do you work? Notice this. This is what I was explaining to you guys. How to use simple present information questions, information questions. What do I do? Where do you work? When do we go to meetings? How do they plan the marketing? What time do you take breakfast? The answers, I supervise the production workforce. I work in the accounting department. We go to the meetings two times a week, but it should be two times a week, not a week, two times a week, dos veces a la semana, a week. No con la T, two times a week. They investigate the customer's need. I take breakfast at 8 a.m. So what are you going to do right now? You are going to write information questions using what and where, and you are going to ask and answer these questions, okay? As I was doing in my, in my whiteboard. Okay, you use your imagination and similar to this one, simple question. Where do you live? Where were you born? Okay. Eh, oraciones simples, preguntas de información simples. Okay. What time do you have lunch? Okay. Another one. What time do you go to bed? What time do you watch TV? And so on. Uh, Veronica, what is your favorite musical group? <laughs> so simple like that. Uh, what is your favorite food, your favorite drink, your favorite spot to go on vacation, tu lugar favorito para ir de vacaciones, okay? So use your imagination and creativity and create. You're going to create, uh, let me see, 10 questions, 10 information questions. You're going to be asking and answering in the breakout rooms. And later you come back and you present your questions, but you are going to address the questions to the other people in the class. Cuando regresemos y hayan practicado sus preguntas y las hayan contestado en los equipos, ah, le van a hacer las preguntas a los otros participantes que no sean de su equipo. ¿De acuerdo? Okay. Let's see if we have a coincidence. Uh, for example, what is your favorite, uh, let's see. Hmm. Food. Oh, uh, yeah, it can be. Uh, I would say, what is your favorite uh, Italian food? ¿Cuál es tu comida Italian. italiana favorita? Pizza. 
<laughs> okay. Gosh. Or some somebody might say uh, lasagna. Yeah. Teacher, son 10 preguntas por todo el grupo o 10 oh, cada uno. Por el equipo, por equipo. Okay. Okay. Con what and where o solo con what? Con what and where. Okay, it can be five and five. You decide, yeah? Use okay. your creativity because later on you're going to be asking an answer here in this main session room, okay? Okay. Okay, okay here we go. Now let's get, ay, pero vamos a armar estos equipos de nuevo porque hay algunos que me lo han dejado solito. Bueno, I'm going to send you the invitation right now. Okay, the invitation. Is there? Go to your groups. And let's see. Thank you, Jonathan. Thank you, Filomena. Thank you, Guillermo. Thank you, Carlos. Hmm. Noé is having problems. Noé, hello, Noé. And Marlene, Marlene, your group. Noé, su equipo es el número tres. Si le llegó la invitación, Noé. Y Marlene, su equipo es el número uno. Le llegó la invitación, Marlene. Marlene, hello. Marlene. Marlene. Ana Marlene. Le llegó la invitación, Ana Marlene. Oh, you're having problems. You're frozen. Okay, let's see. Entonces. <gasps> What are you saying, Elia Filomena? What's that? Don't say that it was recorded. <laughs> oh my God. Oh. Okay, Chico, vean, acá les hace falta Ana Marlene. Ella está teniendo problemas con la conexión. Tan pronto se incorpore, se, le, se las envío, okay? Bye. Okay. Begin Bye. writing the question. Begin writing the question. Bye. Yes. Last name. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Este, yes. What, where, where are you from? Uh-huh. Uh -huh. Where are you from? Sería otra. Uh, I am from San Salvador. Where do you live? <laughs> okay. I live in San Salvador. What? No, where sería where? Uh -huh. Where? Where are you from? Uh, mm -hmm. You from? De donde eres? Yes. Uh, do you do before sleep? ¿Qué haces antes de dormir? Before sleeping. Before sleeping, ok. Porque como llevamos ahí la preposición before, entonces el verbo va ing. Ok, ing. Okay. Before sleeping. Okay. Um, what do you What do you do? Favorite fruit? No. What do you do? No. What? Porque recuerde con el do es para yes no question. What is your favorite food? Okay. Okay. Okay, este José. Okay, eh, yo tengo. Eh, what do you do on the weekend? Francisco. What, what, do you, what is your favorite pet? What is your favorite pet? Yes. What is your favorite? Pet. Pet? P -E -T, Pet. Mascota. Yes, yes. Okay. Yes. Noé and is what, here. Noé is here, class. Uh -huh. Yeah, continue, and, Frank. What is your favorite Mexican food? Chongo Zamorano, she's going to say. <laughs> What is your favorite Mexican food? Chilaquilas. Tacos de virgen. Tacos. 
no, gringas. Me hambre, ¿eh? Hey, hey, gringas. Um, it is Mexican food, but the name is gringas, yes. Gringas. <laughs> Porque sabías, ok, continue. Nos faltan con where. Okay. Tenemos dos, cuatro. Y yo, hice, yo hice dos con what. Con okay. where, no tengo. Number. Number. What oh, is, what is what is your WhatsApp? <laughs> what is your phone number? Okay. Yeah. It's yeah. five 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 o oh, o oh, o oh, one one. Yeah. <laughs> because five 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 is in the in the USA. <laughs> mm -hmm. Okay. What is your phone number, very well? Uh, what is your favorite team, Barcelona or Real Madrid? Your favorite soccer team. Ah, no, en ese caso, en ese no. caso no puede decir what, porque le está dando dos alternativas. Y cuando tenemos un limitado, una alternativas limitadas, utilizamos which. Usted le puede preguntar, what is your favorite soccer team? Y ahí sí, porque tiene todos los equipos del mundo, ¿verdad? Entonces preguntamos what, pero cuando le da dos, tres o cuatro alternativas, ya usamos which, ¿sí? Que okay, en este caso sería what is your favorite soccer team? Soccer team. Okay. Okay. Eh. Muy bien. Voy con la quinta. Ok. What is your favorite dog? Ah, favorite dog. D O G. Dog. One one. Sí. Okay. Por, ah, entonces es como una raza de perro. Por raza. O para, por para para entonces my favorite race race a dog así. Raza es race. I don't know. I don't know, but they say brand. Brand, they say, pero esa es Mark. Pero they say brand. ¿Quién está teniendo problemas que estaba con un dato? Dios mío. ¿Cómo Bandera. queda ese entonces? Is uh, my favorite sure dog is, is um, Alemán Pastor, okay? Germany, okay? <laughs> shepherd, German Shepherd. German Shepherd. German Shepherd. Uh-huh. Permítanme que estoy acá, que Vanessa está apuntando cuando no tiene energía eléctrica y... Es que ha fue arte sí. No, pero ella desde ayer, con la tormenta de ayer en su casa. Entonces, con puro dato en esta. Teacher, is correct when I say, where is your favorite place to go vacation or on vacation? To, get, to go on vacation. On vacation. Ajá, uh -huh, on vacation. Your favorite place, your favorite place to go on vacation. But that's correct. Where is your favorite place to go on vacation? Donde es tu lugar? That would be better if you say what? What is your favorite place? Mm -hmm. Or if you say where do you like to go on vacation? A donde te gusta ir de vacaciones? Where do you like to go on vacation? Where do you like to go on vacation? Or to what is to, to go, go on, on, on vacation, yes. Okay. Yeah. Color. Uh, where is the restroom? Donde está el baño? Where is the church? Donde está la iglesia? No sé, alguno otro. Oh, uh, what time tengo? do you? What time do you have a meeting? When do you have a meeting? Yes. Okay. 
It could be also, yes. <clears throat> ah, pero es que no tienen el when, sino que solo where, right? What, where? Uh -huh. Ajá, sí. when? No, 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 solo dejen la, sí, ya tienen la 10, ¿verdad? Sí, pero podemos okay. agregar un par de No, más. pero ya, ya, ya se las preguntaron. Sí. <risa> ok, ya tienen las respuestas. Um, no, no las anotamos, pero, hey, pero está oh. fácil. <risa> no, but if I say, where is the church? ¿Dónde está la iglesia? Ah. Acá la respuesta es relativa, ¿verdad? Y pueden variar. Mm, sí, porque dependiendo de dónde esté usted. Mm -hmm. Sí. Uh, maybe okay. it, is, it is downtown. De Casidra. Yes, yeah, it is downtown, <laughs> yeah. Or it is in my neighborhood, yeah. Okay, get ready with the answers. Okay. 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 Cada quien, bueno, vamos a ver aquí. Bueno, cada quien sabe cómo se llama y su apellido. <laughs> oh, <sí. laughs> yes, obviously. Well, Yo tengo una. ¿Cuál era la, la, la esa? ¿Cuál era el? Where do you like? Where do you live? Ah, where do you like? Where do you like? Like. Ajá. Uh -huh. Where do you like? Que okay. yo tengo otra. What do you like? Eh? What do you like? Where do you like? Where, where? Ajá. Uh -huh. El complemento luso o ani. Okay. Es el agua. Where do you like? Do, uh, to go for a walk. Where do you like to go for a walk? Very well. Where do you like to go for a walk? Walk. I can. Mm -hmm. Walk. Where? For walk. a walk, 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 a uh, walk, walk, walk for a walk. Yes. Okay, walk. Y la última la tengo dice. What do you where, favorite fruit? Le voy a poner where, yo. <laughs> le voy a dar más volumen. Le voy a dar más volumen a, a aquí porque ya no oigo. Está lloviendo. Ya viene el agua aquí. Bueno. Teacher, where is the party on the weekend? Mm, it is in the, in the city hall. <laughs> en la alcaldía. <laughs> Yo pensé que iba a decir in the beach. At the beach, no. At the beach. It is raining. It is raining. <laughs> okay. It is dangerous. <laughs> When it rains a lot, it's dangerous to be at the beach. Especially at <laughs> night. Oh, you're going to disappear. And, oh my God. Okay, are you ready? Yes? Yes, okay. teacher. Okay, let's get back. Hello, Danny. Hello. Let's get back to the main session room, okay? Okay. Okay, okay teacher. Ah. Let's wait for Ana Marlene, Filomena, Serafín. They are still in their way back. Okay, here we go. Let's see. From group number one, 
only one representative to ask one question to someone else in the class. De cada equipo, un representante le va a hacer una pregunta directa de las information questions que ustedes tienen a uno de los compañeros, compañeras que están acá. Ok. Sí. Prepárense, pues. Mientras, eh, while you get ready, I'm going to call your name to take the second attendance. Ana Marlene. Here I am. Thank you, Miss. Ana Verónica. Present. Thank you. Barbara is absent, right? Carlos Miguel. Here I am. Great. Clelia, she asked for permission, but I don't know. Dani Alberto. Here you are. David Emanuel. Present. Filomena Luz. Present. Okay. Francisco Enrique. Francisco Enrique. Here I am. Okay, great. Guillermo Antonio. Present teacher. Ivania Elizabeth. Present. Thank you. Jonathan. Here I am. Jose Armando. Pacheco. Ah, he said he had to leave. Jose Manuel Mejia. Present teacher. Okay, great. Karina Vanessa. Ah, Vanessa tenía problemas con la conexión. Milagro Mabelin. Present. Noé Isaí. Present teacher. Serafín. Constanza. Pero bien. Pero bien. Oh, thank you. William Francisco. Present. Okay, thank you, class. Now, group number one. Who's going to ask the question? In group number one, we have Ana Marlene, Filomena Luz, Guillermo Antonio, Serafín, Constanza. Okay? Only one to ask one question to the rest of the class. One student from the rest of the class. Okay, me teacher. Okay, Ana Marlene, you say the question goes to, para que esa persona se prepare con la respuesta. The question goes to, y luego hace la pregunta, okay? Okay, the question goes to Ivania Olmedo. Ivania. Okay. okay. Ask me the question. Ask me the question. Okay. Okay. Where can I buy a delicious food? I can buy a delicious food is a, a pizza hut. Okay. You can buy a delicious food at Pizza Hut. Okay, thank you. Now from the other group, we're going to be starving at the end of the um, Carlos Miguel, Jonathan, and William Francisco. One of you is going to ask one question to another partner. Come on, class. In that group. Okay. Ay. Carlos, Carlos. No puedo. Okay, the question goes to. Uh, the question, the question goes to uh, Ana Veronica. Okay, Veronica. Um, okay. Uh, uh, where do you live? I uh, I live in Iloilo. Okay. I live in Iloilo. Okay, thank you so much, great. And now, in the next team, Ana Veronica, Francisco Enrique Saldaña, Jose Mejia, and Milagro Madeli, who's going to ask the question? Okay, Jose. The question was... Mr. Serafín. Okay. <laughs> Terafin, the question goes to you. Hi. Okay. Right. Okay. Um, what is your favorite food? Uh, Chinese food. Chinese food. Okay. Thank you. Okay, thank you. Excellent. Chinese food. 
Chinese food. Thank you. And, and the last group, we have Chinese Nani, David Emanuel, and Ivania. Who's going to ask the question? Hi, teacher. Okay, Danny, the question goes to? Yes. Uh, Mr. Jonathan. Okay, Jonathan, get ready to answer. Yes. Yes. Uh, where are you from? I am from El Salvador. Okay, I saw, I saw that Danny was going to ask it. Que Danny <laughs> You're very excited. Yes, miss. The, the, ¿Cuál es la diferencia entre living and from? Esa pregunta que están haciéndole. ¿Por qué él dice que vive en El Salvador? O sea, cuando decimos from, nos referimos. O sea, ¿cuándo? Where are you from? Where are, where are you from? Where are you from? ¿De dónde? Eres de donde vienes. Ah, from es procedencia, from El Salvador. Como el país. San Salvador. ¿Ya? Yeah. ¿Y vive? Where, where do you live? ¿Dónde vives? San Miguel. Because you are A from, city. maybe, maybe you may say, I am from San Salvador, but I live in San Miguel. That's yes. <clears throat> Soy de San Salvador, pero vivo en San Miguel. Or I am from Guatemala, but I live in El Salvador. Yes? I am from, de donde eres la procedencia. Where do you live? Donde vives en la actualidad. Mm -hmm. Yes? Okay. okay. Thank you for asking. We have this last part. Notice this. What do I do? What is a WH question? Where do you work? Donde trabajas? When do we go to meetings? When, cuando? Okay, acá tenemos otra WH question. When do we go to meetings? We go to meetings two times a week. When do we go to meetings? Cuando o cuantas veces vas a reuniones? How do they plan the marketing? ¿Cómo planean ellos el marketing? They investigate the customer's need. What time do you take breakfast? Tenemos las information questions or WH questions. What, where, when, when, cuando, ¿verdad? How, cómo, what, for example, what time do you take breakfast? ¿A qué hora desayunas? And now we're going to create questions as a class in order to uh, have these answers using what, where, when, how, or what. I have to write a report about the production every Friday. ¿Cuál sería una pregunta adecuada para que nos den esa respuesta? I have to write a report about the production every Friday. Mm -hmm. What? What do you do? Yes. What do you do? You do, do, you do? What, what do, you do you have? When do you have to do? Cuando? Friday. On Friday. Very well. What do you have to do on Friday? Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What do you have to do on Friday? I have to write a report about the production every Friday. Yes. Or another possibility, what do you do at work? Yes or no? It yes. could be another. Yes. Okay. Another possibility. I'm going to write it over here. What do you have to do at work. Entiendo el verbo pues, siempre se incluye en la pregunta. Claro, porque si no, 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 no tiene no sentido. sentido, correcto. Acá miren con do en presente simple, como lo vimos en la semana pasada, ¿se recuerdan? What do you have to do at work? What do you have to do on Friday? And now, I work in the blue building. Ay, is it, yes. Una pregunta, y cabe el, la... La, mm -hmm. la posibilidad de la pregunta, you want to go to a party on Friday? 
Ah, do you want to go? Pero fíjese que acá sería, yes, I do or no, I don't. Y como son information questions, oh. la pregunta está bien, es pero en este sí, contexto la no, porque okay. no coincide okay. con la respuesta, porque es information. Uh -huh. Ajá. Ok. Ya. Yeah. Pero sí me gustaría, pero tengo que hacer esto. Ok. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Porque do you want to, le está pidiendo una respuesta afirmativa o negativa, y acá estamos pidiendo información. Ok. Pero okay. la pregunta está correcta, pero en este contexto no. Ok, I work in the blue building. Mm, piece of well, cake. Very well. Excellent. Well. Very well. Where do you work? I work in the blue building. Now, for Maria and I start working at 10 p.m. What time they work? What time do they work? Do they, they in the verb work. start start working. working? What time do they start working? Very well, people. Now in number four, we designed and others create the new product. We design and others create the new product. What do they belong to? Eh, la What respuesta es design. we. We design. We design. And others create the new product. What, what design? Para What que day? yo conteste con, con right. we, con nosotros, ¿cuál es la, What el pronombre design? personal? What? What? We? No. What? What do? What do? Do we? No. We. No, porque Daisy si contesta con we. You. you. What hey. Excellent. Hey. Uh -huh. What, What do, do you? you? What do you do? Do you do work? At work. Very at well. Work. What do you do at work? Excellent. What do you do at work? Mm, we design and others create the new product. Okay. Um, mm -hmm. They have a meeting because we have to talk about the new inflows and outflows. They have a meeting because, porque we have to talk about the new inflows, inflows and outflows about money. Acá es, fíjense bien, acá no aparece, pero se la voy a decir. Sería como usted está contestando con Vicas, siempre que preguntas con, contestas con Vicas, debes haber preguntado con why, porque está dando una razón. Why do they, porque ellos, why do they have a, excelente. Why do they have a meeting? Esta es la nueva palabra, ¿verdad? Que no aparece acá, pero tiene que ser why. ¿Por qué? Okay. Why do they have a meeting? Uh, they have a meeting because we have to talk about the inflows and outflows. ¿Ok? So you tell me when we can move to the next activity. No, 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 no toques. Oh, no, 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 todavía no. Ok. So, shall we? ¿Podemos continuar? Remember, why, por qué, what do you do? I don't have to explain that because you already know. And where we went deeper into that. How do es para preguntar sobre cómo se realiza algo, ¿verdad? Cómo se eh, lleva a cabo un evento, ¿sí? How do? How do you feel? ¿Cómo te sientes? Yes. Ok, so I'm going to stop sharing over here. And remember people that you have to, to work on the lessons. And today, Lucy Lomena, 
Would you please stay with me sí. 10 minutes? Okay, thank you. Sí. Before, sí, yes. Okay, thank you, class. Have a That's good fine. night. Enjoy the rain and sleep well, okay? See you tomorrow. Don't forget bye. the homework in the platform. Bye-bye. Thank you See for you being tomorrow. here. You did an excellent bye. work today. Bye. Congratulations. You're bye. so bye. Good, good night. Good See night. you tomorrow. Have a good night. Bye-bye. Take care. So long. Bye. Bye-bye. Bye. Have a good night. And Filomena stays with me. Bye-bye, Noé. Take care. Okay, Luz Filomena, veamos acá. Okay. Uh, tenemos las uh, information questions. Ustedes lo van a encontrar en algunos libros como information questions o también lo va a encontrar como WH question words okay okay y si se fija la mayoría aparecen ahí en el manual que serían what where where when when how how why Que era la última yeah. que no aparecía, pero eso se tenía que escribir. Entonces, veamos. Why siempre va a ir unida a because. ¿Por qué le menciono esto, Luz? Porque why significa por qué. Por, por qué. qué. Cuando pedimos una razón, igual que en español. Pero uh -huh. en español, en la respuesta decimos uh -huh. por qué. Por qué. En la pregunta va separado. Decimos por qué. Uy. Uh -huh. Por qué. ¿Verdad? Para preguntar por qué. Por qué. Sí, ese es, eso significa why. Why. Y al igual que en español, contestamos por qué. Siempre vamos a contestar por qué. Pero va junto, miren, en español, en Ajá. inglés es because, ¿ok? Because. Because, yes. If I ask you, why are you happy? ¿Qué me contestaría si yo, cómo me contestaría si yo le pregunto, why are you happy? ¿Por qué estás porque, feliz? Porque estás feliz. Ajá, your answer is? Porque tengo salud. Ok, so, tell me that in English. Uh, si le pregunto con why. Because. Oh, excellent, very well. Because. Because. Um, I am. I am. Healthy. Porque health. tengo salud, estoy saludable, uh -huh. ok. Ok, uh -huh. very well. Fíjese que ahí le estaba preguntando yo una razón, un motivo, ¿verdad? Sí. Y que yo necesitaba información, necesitaba saber por qué usted estaba feliz. ¿Por qué estás uh -huh. feliz? Porque estoy saludable, porque tengo salud. Ok. But if I say, um, yeah. where, where do you have lunch? For example, where do you have lunch? ¿Dónde almuerza? The answer is, uh -huh. where do you uh -huh. have lunch? Uh -huh. Where and work? I have, I have lunch. I have lunch. Yo almuerzo at work. I uh -huh. have lunch at work. Okay. Uh -huh. Very well. I have lunch at work. And another one. When? Do you have lunch? When do you have lunch? ¿A qué hora almuerzas? Seven. Ah, and that is breakfast. ¿Ese desayuno? ¿Almuerzo? No, no, no. No. He <laughs> ido el, el. Ajá. When do you have lunch? 
I am 11. Uh, okay, I, full answer. Uh, I have lunch. I have lunch. At? At? 11 a.m. 11 a.m. Okay, mm -hmm. great. Otra mm. forma de hacer esta pregunta, ¿cuál sería? Si yo le pregunto de la hora en la que almuerzas. Otra forma de preguntar es. Guay. No, porque ahí sería no, porque almuerzas. Porque, de, ajá. Ajá. Eh, otra Para preguntar. Where? La hora, no, eso es. No. ¿Dónde? Para preguntar la hora en la que tú almuerzas. What no. time? Why? No. What, what time? Ah. Do you? ¿Qué hora? Ajá. Uh -huh. ¿Qué hora? Uh, what time uh, do you have lunch? What time do you have lunch? Yes. Uh -huh. ¿A qué hora yes. almuerzas? Okay. Uh -huh. Y si yo le digo, how do you? How do you go to work? How do you go to work? ¿Cómo te vas al trabajo? How do you go to work? Uh, I go to work by bus. I work. I go to work by car. I go to work by plane. I go to work by taxi. I go to work by Uber. Okay. Mm -hmm. so no, I, caminando. Ah, I have. Okay. I know how I, do you go to work. I go to work. I go to work, go to work. on foot. Me voy a pie. Y otra I forma sería foot. I walk to work. Walk. I walk to work. Mm -hmm. I go to work on food or I walk to work. Sí, entonces si se fija acá, en todas estas um, oraciones, yo, que son interrogaciones, ¿verdad? Preguntas, sí. le he estado pidiendo información. Sí, por eso se llama sí. information sí. question. Sí. Pero question. también se le conoce como WH question words. ¿Por qué? Porque todas llevan una W y una H en ellas, excepto how. No la lleva en el mismo orden, pero uh -huh. tiene en esa palabra una H, una W. ¿sí? W. Muy bien. Sí. Entonces, <coughs> veamos. Si yo le digo, do you like... Um, Do you like bananas? ¿Cuál sería la respuesta? Yes, I do. Excellent. Very well. Uh -huh. Yes, I do. Si se yes, fija, I es, do. Excellent. Estas son yes, no questions que estuvimos trabajando la semana pasada, ¿sí? En uh -huh. respuesta sí. corta. ¿Por qué? Porque acá decíamos, tenemos la posibilidad de contestar de forma afirmativa o negativa. O negativa. Correcto, por eso se le llama yes, no questions. Y fíjese que la pregunta comienza con el verbo auxiliar do, ¿verdad? Do. O podría comenzar con das, pero en este das. caso, las information questions, quiero que le quede bien clarito eso, Luz, que en las information questions nunca vamos a comenzar preguntando con do o das. No, no, no. Tiene que uh -huh. ser una... W H what? question what where ah. when how why who y así uh -huh. sucesivamente ok ahora uh -huh. yo quisiera que yes. usted me construyera una pregunta una pregunta utilizando una de estas palabras ok construya me trate de construirme una pregunta una pregunta sería sí. eh. Wow. Utilizando cualquiera de estas. ¿no? Uh -huh. Sería. What is your favorite food? Excellent. Very well. Great. My favorite food is pupusas. 
Yeah, to tell you an example. Okay. Or, mm -hmm. what is your name? What is your last name? Yes? Mm -hmm. Yes. Yes. Pregunta. Okay. Y fíjese que también tenemos acá how. Si se recuerda, hemos estado trabajando también la semana pasada. How do you spell your name? Yes. ¿Se recuerda que estuvimos yes. trabajando eso? How do you spell your name? Y si yo le hago esta pregunta, Luz, how do you spell your name? La respuesta sería. What? How do you spell your name? How do you spell your name? Um, I am. Um... No. No. Porque no, no es. It's, it's very well. Excellent. Uh -huh. It's. It's your. Your. Mm, es el. Your name. Your name. ¿Cómo le traes tu nombre? It's. It's. El. El. You. Sí. Excellent, very well. Yo te dije, Filomena iba a deletrear. It's L U Z. Okay, excellent. Very well. Okay, Luz, thank you very much for giving me these 10 minutes. Thank I you. think that now it is a little bit clearer. Okay, creo que está un poquito más claro, ¿verdad? Lo que estábamos trabajando. Sí. Y yes. le va a costar un poquito menos sí. la, el trabajo en la plataforma. And now it's time for you to go to bed with your babies, okay? Okay. Thank you. Niños. Have a good night. Thank you very good much night. for joining and I hope to see you tomorrow. Okay. Have a good night. Thank bye. you. Bye. bye. Sweet dreams. Good night. Take care. Have a good night. Bye. Good night. Bye bye. Lose. Bye bye.